Welcome for the word to the day for March 30th. The topic is the Lord is faithful. He will strengthen and protect you. And that's the second Thessalonians 3, verse 3, NIV version. Don't worry, God is faithful. Let's bow for a word of prayer. Heavenly Father, we know you're faithful, Lord. We thank you for your faithfulness, Lord, that we can trust in you, Lord, to protect us and guide us and direct us, Lord. We thank you. We pray this all in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Don't worry, God is faithful. Most of our worries can be summed up in two words. What if? What if a medical test are bad? What if a market plummet? What if a mate walks out? What if I lose my job? The list is endless. Fear involves torment. 1 John 4, 18. And by uh, focusing on your worries instead of God's faithfulness, uh, you're letting Satan torment you, but you don't have to. Jesus tells us to not be fearful and unsettled. John 14, 27. Paul says, leave no room for the devil, uh, give no opportunity to him, Ephesians 4, 27. And Solomon writes, the day of uh, the day of the of afflicted are made evil by anxiety, thoughts, and forebodings. Uh, but he who has a glad heart has a continual feast, regardless of circumstances. Amen. Proverbs 15, 15. If you're afraid of what lies ahead, stop and look back at God's faithfulness. He is utterly trustworthy. He, he will fulfill his call by howling, howling and keeping you. In 1 Thessalonians 5, 24. So if you are plagued by worry, here are some Bible uh, promises you can stand on. Praise the Lord who has given rest to his people. Just as he promised, no one has, has failed of all the good promise he gave, 1 King 8, 56, NIV. You say, but I fail God. I can really expect him, I can't really expect him to help me. Yes, because even if you are faithless, he remains faithful, 2 Timothy 2.13. Before God redeemed you and made you his child, he was aware of all your faults, flaws, and failures. Nevertheless, his word says he is faithful and he will strengthen you and protect you, uh, protect you from the evil one. So the word for today is don't worry, God is faithful. Amen. So that's all you have to think about is God is faithful. No matter what you're going through. He's faithful and you can count on his promises. Well, thank you, Lord, for your promises and being faithful, Lord. We pray this all in Jesus' name. Amen.